give it up for Thomas the Boxer. Well, hello everybody. Uh, my name is Thomas. I'm an alcoholic. Sorry, wrong habit. Start again. My name is Thomas. I'm a world champion kickboxer. And even though I used to fight in front of thousands of people in my earlier days, uh, coming performing in front of a couple hundred people made me shit my pants. <laughs> and I, I was trying to find a way to feel better about it, and I was like, well, the best thing uh, that can happen is even if you're underprepared, nobody's gonna kick your ass in front of everybody. <laughs> and however, if somebody doesn't laugh, just remember who it is and kick his ass when you're done. <laughs> So, I'm watching. <laughs> uh, I was born in a country where everybody loves the food, loves the wine, and hates the people. <laughs> France. <laughs> Any French people here? Yeah. They don't like you anyway. <laughs> so, uh, however, I am raised in Brooklyn. Wow, you're from Brooklyn over there? Where in Brooklyn? All right. Very cool. Well, I'm from the Brooklyn of Paris. You know what I mean? And uh, I know what you think, like it's not the same, but I had McDonald's in my Brooklyn, except I had Le Big Mac on my menu. Also had KFC, except it was real chicken on the menu. And uh, all the Dunkin' Donuts that I could find didn't have any donuts, but I had baguette and croissant, okay? <laughs> uh, there's one thing that strikes me about the cliche about French people is, why do you guys, and I'm thinking you as American majority, think that we don't shave our armpits and we stink? <laughs> like, have you, got be have you guys been to Williamsburg lately? <laughs> Just saying. So, I was tired of masturbating and I really wanted to fuck a stranger. So, sign up on Tinder. Like everybody else. And Tinder is really cool. Like, in, a, in about 10 minutes, you can learn so much about your neighborhood. Wow. In one mile around myself, I had 15 Tiffany's who love adventure. And are looking to ride a horse. <laughs> I was like, oh, I can't help you with that. <laughs> so I start swiping and swiping and swiping and swiping. And after an hour of swiping, I'm like, there's something wrong here. I keep having all these matches with these ladies that are actually not attracted to. And it took me a bit, and I realized I was swiping in the wrong direction. <laughs> That, I know. So, as a very polite guy, I decided to correct my mistake and before unmatching these ladies, I sent them all of them a message saying, I'm sorry, I'm gonna have to unmatch you, you are not my type. <laughs> hey, cool guy, okay? I know this is not New York, it's fuck you, bye. And uh, so, the next day when I went back on my new Tinder with all the matches that I thought it was gonna be the right type, I was banned. And I was like, what the fuck? I fucking paid 30 bucks to match a maximum of chick that I like and that potentially liked me and like horse riding. <laughs> and, and I'm now I'm banned and they don't even tell you what you did wrong. I'm like, what is my honesty? So basically I was like, I fast forward. I called the hotline and the guy said, you've been You've been violating the guidelines. I'm like, fuck you, I haven't been violating any girls yet, yo. <laughs> so anyway, I'm on a date with Tiffany number 15. <laughs> and she really want to pick that restaurant, it's a vegan place. I have nothing against vegan people until you make me feel bad for not having feeling for animals feeling. Hey, I want the animals to be happy too. Pick up my lettuce, give it to the rabbit, give me that rabbit. And I'm trying that impossible burger. 
And she keep looking at me like, so? So? Like it's something crazy. And I'm like, well, I'm like, yeah, like it's, it's like a burger, like, kind of. <laughs> and she's like, no, nah, come on, Thomas. Like, it is, be it is better than a burger. And you know, they really want to convince you this is better. And I'm like, kind of, but not really. She's like, no, nah, it is better. And I'm like, Tiffany, I'm like, I gotta be honest. It smells like it, tastes like it, but this is not like it. She's like, Thomas, you're making a whole thing. It is better. I'm like, all right, I'm going to explain you in a better way. If I was a pedophile, and you tried to throw me a midget, I'm sorry, guys, but this is not the same thing. All right. All right, thank you, everybody. You've been great.